Metal casting for sculpture art is a long process and requires a team and attention to detail. Eventually, As with the creation of all art, you must first begin with the artist and the inspiration. It can come from anywhere, really. One could look at a bee pollinating a sunflower and think nothing of the bee itself. But the grooves of the flower and its perfect pattern are entrancing. The spiral of a shell or the points of a starfish. Each leg behaves with its own indents, peaks and valleys. Fibonacci and nature fascinate me in particular. I love where they show up. Fractals. My sculpting professor said, anyone can make something cool on accident. Can you use the tools to make a conscious work of art? We used mesh mixer. There are moments when you feel like you are studying a bit of pattern forever. Then things can come together in a moment with just one 30 degree turn. I like where this is going. Sometimes you have to scale back your tangents in a class setting. What I love about metal casting in this setting is more about the camaraderie between the fellow student artists. The sink we all had to be in to have a successful iron pour. We are all vested in our ideas coming into fruition. I guess in that way we're all a little selfish. But it's a small bit of it. You can't afford for it to affect the process. It's dangerous if you do. The planning and preparation leads up to hot and heavy work. And there's no way to do this part alone.
for me and my team was my classmates, guided by our professor. They were there through every failure and every aha moment. I think the end result is a birth of that, individuality and the unity, and an amazing balance that I can hold in my hand.